Hello, here's the video on how to install SmartLab software. Here are the list of the supported systems. IIS service are default in these systems. This is the requirement for the screen resolution. If you have an older version installed already, you need to uninstall it first. Copy the activation code in the TXT file and it can be reused in the new version. Close the software and uninstall it. Locate XMARLA folder. The path is different for 22-bit system and 64-bit system. Open the folder, select and delete all the files that can be deleted. To download the software, visit the Tectronic website www.tech.com and search TSL3000B. Download the software with the latest version available. Once finished, decompress the file. Open the installation instruction file. There are four steps on how to install TechSmartLab software. Step one is to install the exe file. Right click and choose run as administrator. Following the instruction to finish the installation. Step 2 is to install Donet Framework. Click the link to download the installation package. Run the installation. If you have an equivalent version or higher version installed already, you can skip this step. Step 3 is to install the database. Click the link to download the installation package compliant with your operation system. This is the file for 32-bit system. This is for 64-bit system. We use 64-bit as an example. Choose the file and to download. Copy the downloaded file into the folder. Right click SQL2014 install.bat file and choose run as administrator. Press any key to continue and follow the instruction to finish the installation. It takes around 20 minutes to finish. Press any key to finish. Choose SQL2014 configure.bat file. Right click and choose run as administrator. Press any key to start. Follow the instruction and press any key to finish. Step 4. 
install and configure IIS service. Right click IIS install configure.bat file and choose run as administrator. Click OK and follow the instruction. It takes around 10 minutes to finish. Press any key to finish. If you are working with Windows 8 and 10 system, extra settings are required. In Control Panel, select Program and Features. Select Turn Windows Feature on or off. Find the Application Development Features. and the common HTTP features. Tick all the items and click OK to finish. Reboot your computer to finish the installation. That's all for this video. Thank you.